are going to discuss about the unit step function or heavy side function so it is defined as it is a discontinuous function and it is given as u of t minus a or we can denote by h of t minus a as well which is equal to 1 when t is greater than or equal to a and 0 when t is less than a a is nothing but a constant okay so this is the given thing about unit step function and we are going to find the laplace transform of this and we have going to do some problems based on laplace transform in the case of unit step function or heavy side function so always remember laplace transform of unit step function is given as e power minus a s divided by s this is the formula for laplace transform of unit step function remember this formula one more thing the mostly the problems will be based on this type of laplace transform where laplace transform will be given function of t minus a into u unit step function of t minus a in this form they might give you the problem so laplace transform of this is given as e power minus a s into f of s as we know what is f of s capital f of s it is nothing but the laplace transform of f of t so this is a thing you need to remember this formula this type in which we will be solving some problem so here we have one problem Laplace transform of 3t square plus 4t plus 5 into unit step function u of t minus 3 here you can observe that this part as we have discussed this is nothing but f of t minus a and this is u of t minus a where a is nothing but 3 that you need to remember so I can write f of t minus 3 is equal to what 3t square plus 4t plus 5 then this will be the first step writing f of t minus a a is nothing but here 3 next step you need to consider t minus a as any variable other than t okay any variable you can take I will take it as s x okay so t minus 3 is x that means what t minus 3 is equal to x so what will be t t is equal to x plus 3 so i will substitute t value in this equation that's it this is the second step what we need to do f of t minus a you have to write after that you have to replace f of t f of t minus a that means t minus a with any of the variables i'll take x then in terms of t you have to write and substitute this value in the given equation so it will be 3 of x plus 3 square plus 4 into x plus 3 plus 5 so you need to simplify this equation a plus b the whole square a square plus 2 into a into b so 6 x plus 9 plus this also you need to simplify so it is nothing but 4x plus 12 plus 5 so all together we need to simplify this equation and get a final form 3x square plus 18x plus 27 plus 4x plus 12 plus 5 so select the like terms and I'll add them up okay so you'll get it as 3x square plus 22x plus 44 27 plus 17 will give me 44 so this is the final equation in terms of x so we have got f of x we have got what f of x function of x now what we need to do so what is our intention our intention is to find out f of s 
okay so for that what i can do after finding out f of x so f of s i can write it as laplace transform of f of t which is equal to f of t will be equal to f of x therefore i have to just find the laplace transform of this whole thing so x you can assume it as t as well okay no problem in that so i'll just find out 3x square so 3 x square you need to find the laplace transform so laplace transform of t power n is n factorial by s raised to n plus 1 so here you can see n, fa n factorial n what is n over here 2 so 2 factorial by s raised to n plus 1 that will be 3 plus 22 is a constant Laplace transform of x again 1 factorial 1 by s, ra s raised to 1 plus 1 it is 2 and constant term is there so I can write it as 44 by s since n is n will be x x power 0 I can write okay so we have got the final this thing but the thing is that we have the for this type of problem the final answer should be in the form of e power minus a s into f of s correct now what is e power minus a s so the final answer of this equation i can write it as e power minus a a is nothing but here 3 s into this whole thing that is 6 by s cube plus 22 by s square plus 44 by s this will be the final answer so i have taken one more problem here you can see so e power minus t into u of t minus 2 so first step is that t minus a this is this is nothing but f of t minus a into u of t minus a so a will be 2 correct so i'll write first f of t minus a a is 2 so f of t minus 2 is equal to this one that is e power minus t now t minus 2 i'll assume it as x so therefore f of x will sorry therefore x is equal to what t minus 2 this part so from here t will be 2 plus x correct so i have to replace here t with 2 plus x so that becomes e power minus t with 2 plus x so so simplifying e power minus is there so minus 2 minus x is there correct so e power minus 2 into e power minus 6 okay so this is the simplification so just a simplification now we have simplified this form now this will be equal to what f of x as we know this we assume it as x so this will be f of x now we have to find the laplace transform of this so f of x we have got it as e power minus 2 into e power minus x now we need to find out f of s capital f of s which is nothing but the laplace transform of f of t which we can say it is uh, equal to f of x itself so we need to find the laplace transform of this form that is given as e power minus 2 so laplace transform of this will be what so here we can say e power minus 2 is a constant value write it as it is into e power minus x is not a constant value we have to find the laplace transform of this as we know laplace transform of so i'll write it here laplace transform of e power a t what is that here e power a t t is a variable over here so here we can consider it as t also that's fine so anyways f of t is equal to f of x e power at is nothing but 1 by s power s minus a what is a over here 1 minus 1 so it becomes 1 by s plus 1 correct so the final answer will be e power minus a s what is a over here 2 so 2 s into f of capital f of s that is nothing but this part e power minus 2 by s plus 1 will be the final 
and so don't forget about this okay we are our intention is to find out first f of s capital f of s anyways we'll get it directly from the question itself this part 